Carbon dioxide is the main reason for the acidification of the world's oceans. A quarter of carbon dioxide emissions end up in the sea, more than 2 billion tonnes of the gas being absorbed by the oceans each year. Acidity is measured by pH, or power of hydrogen values. Above 7 is alkaline, below acidic. A century ago, surface seawater had a reading of 8.2. Today it is 8.1. By 2100 it is predicted to be 7.8. That may sound minuscule, but it already represents an increase in acidity of 30%, with dire consequences for the ecosystem. And will mean a 150% increase by the end of the century. The increased acidity plays havoc with levels of calcium carbonate, which forms the shells and skeletons of many sea creatures and disrupts reproductive activity, hampering photosynthesis in many microorganisms. But it can also encourage the growth of algae and other vegetable matter. Scientists at the Oceanography Institute in Villefranche-sur-Mer, near Nice on the French Riviera, plan to simulate these altered states in order to study the effects. By sealing off a small area of the Mediterranean, they will artificially create the conditions predicted for the latter half of the century and attempt to evaluate the problems in store.